Hello everyone and welcome to our channel Tiki Zone. In this video we are going to discuss about what is water pollution, what are the causes, effects and control measures of water pollution. First of all we have to know that what is this water pollution means. Water pollution is a change in the quality of water physically, chemically and biologically so that it adversely affect the living organisms. It mainly occurs due to addition of physical and chemical pollutants to natural water. Then let us discuss what are the causes of water pollution. Hot waste water from ice factory and other industrial waste water when mixed in river or sea it pollute the water. Acid mine drainage into river also pollute water. Solid wastes like litter, plastic bottles, polythene etc. when thrown in lake, pond etc. also cause water pollution. Then raw home sewage, urban runoff when mixed with river or any natural water source also cause water pollution. Then idle immersion in river, pond etc. cause water pollution. Washing vehicles, clothes in river, pond water also cause water pollution. Application of large amount of fertilizers and pesticides in crop field when mixed with nearby pond or river water also pollute their water. Then leakage in underground storage chemical tanks cause underground water pollution. When oil mixed with water during extraction from oil rigs or seep accident then it also pollute sea water. Then let us discuss what are the effects of water pollution. When human uses pollute water it cause many waterborne diseases like diarrhea, typhoid and many more. Large amount of human waste in water increase bacteria like E. coli streptococcus species which causes intestinal disorders and pneumonia etc. in human beings respectively. Then nitrates containing drinking water cause blue baby syndrome, phosphate containing drinking water cause bone marrow disease, fluorine containing drinking water cause fluorosis etc. Then high level of organic chemicals like acid toxic metals make the water unfit to drink. Then chemically pollute water when applied in crop field it also affect the crop yield. Then thermal pollution decrease oxygen level in water. It also change the breeding cycle of various aquatic or organisms. Then addition of more organic matters into water cause decrease in oxygen level which cause death of oxygen dependent aquatic plants and animals. Inorganic pollutants like phosphorus etc cause unnecessary algal blooms called eutrophication. Then excessive pesticides mixed with natural water leads to biomagnification and accidental oil spills in ocean decrease oxygen level also cause death of aquatic animals. Then let us discuss what are the controlling measures of water pollution. Industries must purify their waste water before releasing into natural water bodies. Also ice factory must cool down their hot waste water before releasing into pond, river etc. Humans must avoid throwing litters into river, pond etc. Idle immersion must be done in artificial ponds. Providing waste water treatment facility in urban areas. We must focus on reuse and recycle of water by applying required amount of fertilizers in paddy fields and making pools so that chemical water during rain does not get mixed with nearby pond etc. Washing vehicles and clothes in river pond etc. must be prohibited to maintain the quality of natural water. We must plant trees in barren areas to check soil erosion by rainwater. Then we must educate people and spread awareness about causes, effects and control measures of water pollution. So these are some causes, effects and control measures of water pollution we discussed in this video. Thanks for watching.